just getting rid of. Okay, here we go. Alright, let's get it, y'all. First game of Cheese League November 2021. Oh, we get to hear the frame one clicky clacks. That's nice. Oh, listen to that. Listen to Coffee Rex go. He's like on that side of the stage as well. That's so nice. Kale looking pretty good so far. Not bad, not bad. Perfect levels, that's what I like to hear. Alright. This should be the stock for Coffee Rex though. Just needs to rinse repeat this edge guard one more time. Oh, good movement from Caleb. Good like uh, pressure in the corner without throwing anything. You just want to move on the platform if you want to scare the, the homie into a quick, uh, into giving you a quick hit. All right, though. Coffee Rex evening the game. Doing all right so far. Alright, so while I was promoting the stream, uh, Coffee Rex has actually come out with a nice handy little lead on, on himself right now. Oh my god, that was a crispy wave dash back um, up to it. Caleb needs to... Okay, nice job. He actually held his stage position there, really well done. Oh, that laser's actually gonna get punished. Oh, nice down throw tech chase. Oh, this could be the stock if Caleb executes properly. Okay, he knew the uh, hard angle was gonna come. Oh my god, that up tilt. These up tilts are very scary if you're Falcon, in my, uh, if I'm being honest. Good there, knee. Grab the ledge. Oh, uh, accidentally gets the top ornament winner. Oh, damn. The reverse. Up smash off the side is actually ridiculous. But Coffee Rex going 1 0 up. Um, we're definitely going to run uh, all the games on stream today and all best of five because we have that luxury. <laughs> Coffee Rex literally being in Twitch chat while he's on the stage. What an absolute fiend. Oh, nice. <laughs> That's my dodge. 
Yeah, we're just gonna run every game on stream, Sam. <laughs> Hearing that frame one heavy is kind of crispy in your ears. Not gonna lie. Oh. Caleb actually getting the roll in, uh, catching Cover X, just grabbing the corner. Uh, he needs to find something like. I don't know. He actually needs to find a, a chance to hit him while he's got all this pressure going in the corner, you know? Because that's what's happening a lot, is like, Caleb has the free, like, stage to move around. Um, and he's like, making the person in the corner actually pretty pressured. But then, like, he doesn't actually convert it into anything that, like, results in a stop. So I feel like he can just do that, like, when he's playing neutral. Uh, he doesn't have to come down with a respawn platform to do that. Oh, damn. Alright, nice. Oh, this punish is actually pretty good for Coffee Rack. 67 off the rip. Caleb finally managing to reset to neutral. Alright, careful now. Caleb trying to fight his way back to center. It actually does work out for them uh, in the end. Hmm. I don't know about Caleb jabbing and then doing a dash dance into nothing. Because usually if you're doing that jab, you're like trying to check them. And then if you jab them and they don't do nothing, you go in, basically. So I want to see J Caleb like do jab and then like show up knee. Because jab and then dash dance, all you're getting is stage. And the way Coffee Rex is playing right now, he's like really comfortable moving in and out of the corner. Oh, there you go. That was a good read. That was a good read. Well done. Right, really good follow-up to Coffee Rex. Caleb, not DI'ing any particular way. Oh, comes back with an air. And, oh, two knees! He's dead! He's actually dead at 70. Caleb's in this now. That was a yucky stock. That was a yucky, yucky stock. Alright, pretty even though. It's anyone's game. Hopefully, Caleb actually gets a win on Dreamland. I want to see that the most right now. Uh, these gentlemen cancels haven't been uh, haven't gone so great for Caleb this set. Oh, good knee. Oh, why did he go to the left like that? Maybe he just flubbed on his controller. Some L miss L cancels here and there as well. Oh, that trade worked out not too bad for him. There's your gentleman. That's what he's looking for. Nice knee. He's actually got the uh, stage control uh, really hardcore now. He's whiffing some moves to make sure Kaka Rex doesn't just uh, mindlessly approach. Um, that said, he's uh, being really mobile on the stage and he's kind of like crossing over a bit more frequently than maybe he needs to just like keep the control. Oh, but there you go. The knee's gonna take it. And we're going to 1 1. We actually have a match on our hands. Hold on. Let's go, Caleb. Let's go, Caleb. FD time. The scariest stage if you're Falcon versus Fox. Oh, that really just hits. Oh, there you go. One more. Oh, just barely off with that um dash jump. Just like somehow wasn't the right spacing. It's okay though, it's not the worst thing in the world. He's still got his percent, but now this means that Coffee Rex gets to just uh, play the neutral and wait for this Falcon to whiff something laggy and then do, you know, infinite wave shine. Oh, and he's got the lasers. How scary. There you go. Knock down into grab. So far, Coffee Rex is actually doing a really good job at um, putting himself at a range where Falcon actually wants to uh, act, but isn't fast enough to like beat out the Nair, basically. 
You saw it a couple times there. He just threw out the air and uh, the Falcon kind of ran into it. Like, even if it was weaker, it still worked. Um, Stomp Knee is going to take it though. Classic combo. Really hard, by the way. <laughs> Got a Caleb Craigasm in chat. What's up, Skip? Glad you're a fan. Ooh, big knee. The up throw into Tech Reed knee. Caleb. Suddenly gets some momentum for himself back. Ooh, just gets hit with a wave dash back. Two up tilt. Man, frame one is bullshit. Oh, there you go. Nah. Into knee, into edge guard. Doing well. Oh, great shine from Guffy Rex there. He knew the get up attack was coming, but he got hit anyway. There's that Nair I was talking about. Perfect range for Falcon to eat it, basically. Oh, I don't know why. Yeah, that was a dead Falcon off of that uh, missed side B, if I'm being honest. Yeah, both of them kind of flubbing for the next hit, but Coffee Rex just doing a full hop and a double jump, and uh, the timing was enough to beat the Captain Falcon. Some clean neutral going on now. Caleb giving up a little bit of stage here. Try Clyde, thank you for the follow. Caleb should close this. Nice read on the tech in place. Yes, the whole bracket is a four-man round robin. We're doing free entry because why would we ask people to pay for this? They still pay for venue though. Because look, let's be real. Out of the four people in this round robin, I'm not going to force them to give me money. I already got my entry fee. My, uh, I already got my um, my venue fee floated because I'm an organizer. And that's all I need. Oh, good neutral, actually. Oh, damn. Caleb holding tight center right now. Great grab, too. Oh, shit. Oh, shit! Coffee Rack slow off the ledge. Gets hit by the returning um, up air. So far, Coffee Rex is doing a good job of like placing his aerials, but he's not like uh, going ham and mashing them on the Captain Falcon, which sometimes you can do. You can just like run at him with a nair plane and then um, go from there. Oh, there's the shine that's going to take it though. Catching the up B, just extending like that, and Coffee Rex is going to go 2-1 up. These guys literally hopped on to their tournament match after being like on the friendly setup behind them. Uh, for a solid like 30 minutes. Razco, welcome. Why is Caleb going to take him though? What's going on? Um, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, back into it. Yeah, the CRT time. I had to like filter out the high pass. All right, so Battlefield for this next game though, not looking too good for um, Caleb so far, but it is one of Falcon's better stages. I just think that Coffee Rex probably has the uh, comfort of this stage, and that's probably what's going to be carrying him to, to a win, possibly. Caleb's starting to find some ground, though. He's uh, actually holding the center, and he finds the knee. No tech on that. Yeah. And what a way to turn it around, actually. What a way to turn it around. Well played. Alright, Cover X still hasn't managed to finish it off, but actually, in saying that, won the neutral, came out in with a short hub nair and took the stop. Alright, Caleb not going for the platform there. Trying to find center, Puffy Rex just holding with shield and wave dash in up tilt. It's really scary for Falcon to approach right now. He's, yeah, just playing these wave dash, uh, like, like wave dash back up tilts against the Falcon. Yeah, great job. That was so clean. That's how I like to play as Falco versus um versus Falcon. 
you just hold that center and you do these up tilts, it makes it really hard for him to do a stomp on you unless you timed it right. Oh, damn, that just pokes. Oh, chance for Caleb here. Knees. Tries for a tech chase. He's burned his double jump. That is a huge blunder. Yeah, coming back with that double jump just... Uh, oh, hey! I like that. I think Caleb can clean up the stock right now if he wants, but he's just got to... He's just got to space a bit better. And when I say that, like... What I mean is, like, Caleb is whiffing a lot of moves. But then when he's, like, going to attack for realsies, he's still whiffing. And so that that just means the Fox gets to come in with an air and, like, beat whatever Falcons is putting out in the air. Alright. What's he got? He's got the back air. He knew that wasn't going to be enough to kill him, and he stays on stage with the forward tilt. He actually cleans it up. Doing well so far. Oh, great up air from Caleb. And I like that he um, didn't attack there. Like, he went for a bait just by doing the short hog. That was pretty nice. Caleb just needs to not get flustered here. Just needs to find his grab. Or he might just be looking for a knee. There it was. He got the, the nair. Oh my god, that up tilt is just devastating Caleb right now. Oh! Here's a chance for Caleb to bring it back. But he keeps letting these, like, rare offstage instances slip. He doesn't let it slip that time. Finally, cleaning up the stock. And he's got... He's taking a lot of damage, so this is going to be hard for him to come back. Oh, he comes back with an air. Tech chase time. He had it for a second there. But now, Coffee Rex. With a little bit of momentum. This is so tricky for Falcon to come back from. Oh, but he gets the up beat. I like that Caleb just waved dash down and went to the ledge there, but... This is so easy to flow chart if you're Fox, and that's going to be it. 3-1 to Coffee Rex. Well done. 